Portland itself has probably the most beautiful parks there are. But when you think about like a signature park, Provincial Park Community Center, as far as its beauty, everything that it has, from the big trees, to the rose garden, to the fountain, to the community center, to the diversity in the park, to be able to have a place to go where even if you don't have a dime in your pocket, you can still participate. That's huge. Portland Parks and Recreations, I found it to be probably the best uh, daycare I ever experienced growing up. And so when I had the opportunity to join the board, I was definitely uh, jumping on the opportunity. My father having been um, the commissioner who was over uh, Portland Parks and also being the director of Portland Parks and Recreations for 13 years, uh, definitely has had impact in, in my love and commitment to Portland Parks. Uh, even when I was asked to join the board, I never felt like I had to do it out of obligation because my father was the director, but out of opportunity. Uh, just for the, for the legacy that he left, for the, for the work that he started, and definitely for the love that he planted within me, uh, within Parks. My father and I would often shoot baskets. Of course, we always had to have our, our game of horse. And I will tell you, by the time he reached uh, 70, I got him every time. <laughs> <laughs> Took a while. Um, and then other than that, it, it's walking and it was really learning. I, it's teachable moments. I actually grew up in the Selwood area, so the southeast side of town. But rumor had it that the best basketball players were in North Northeast Portland. So at age 12, myself and some of my boys would take a bus from Selwood all the way to Peninsula Park and play there, just to play against some of the best competition. Uh, I will admit uh, they kicked our butts, <laughs> but, but they let us play. Jefferson being right there, Roosevelt not too far along, um, definitely made one of the neighborhoods uh, and one of the places to go. To see how good were you, you know, bragging right, street credit. <laughs> you know, that's where you earned your street credit. It was that it was at Peninsula Park playing the outside court and the inside courts. That was my earliest memories around uh, Peninsula Park. But then as I got older, it's the place where my wife and I took our wedding pictures uh, at the beautiful Rose Garden that's there. And now my daughters uh, go there, take classes there. Things like that mean a lot. You know, so as, as years go by and you walk through the park or you walk through the Rose Garden, you can't help but remember, you know, the, the, those key moments. And so uh, playing with them as a child and seeing them outgrow the little swing and outgrow the little slide and, and graduate to the big swing and the big slide, then graduate from there to the basketball court, it's just, you know, it, it's, it's pretty awesome.